Hermann Göring was born on January 12, 1893, in Bavaria. He joined the Nazi party in 1922, and quickly became a firm favorite of Hitler's. During a failed coup in 1923, Göring was shot in the leg, and subsequently developed an addiction to morphine. Instrumental in assisting Hitler to take power in 1933, he was rewarded by being made the second most powerful man in Germany. In 1933, he founded the Gestapo, and by 1935, he had become the commander-in-chief of the Luftwaffe. By 1942, with the Luftwaffe's performance falling very short of Hitler's expectations, Göring's position was substantially reduced, he was less active in the political and military aspects of the war, and concentrated more on the acquisition of artwork and property, the majority of which had been seized from the Jewish Holocaust victims. His complete downfall would come in April of 1945, when on the 22nd, he was advised of Hitler's intentions to commit suicide, and he sent a communication to his Führer seeking permission to allow him to assume control of the Reich. So incensed was Hitler, he immediately called for Göring to be removed from every one of his positions, barred from the party, and issued an order for his arrest, on the grounds of treason. After the Second World War, Hermann Göring was tried at Nuremberg, found guilty, and convicted of war crimes and crimes against humanity, he was sentenced to be hanged. He committed suicide on October 15, 1946.